so uh, first of all I am carrying a backpack most of the time simply because of my lifestyle as a student living in Germany um, because if you don't know uh, I think Germany's uh, public transport is pretty good so it's not like in America you have to go everywhere by car uh, here at least for me I go to most places by tram or by uh, subways I also go to my groceries most of the time after classes so that means I need a bag that I can also uh, put my groceries inside and carry with me so although I do have some handbags they are simply not practical because you know if you drive a car of course you, you only need to carry your groceries from the supermarket back to your car and then you drive whereas if you have to go to places by walking or by public transport it's too heavy to carry a handbag in my opinion for some people uh, it, the aesthetic is more important for me practicality is key so that's why so I got this bag uh, for I think for like 20% off uh, and this is by this uh, brand called Burton um, and I have some uh, pins on so I got this one that I bought from a stationery shop in China and those two are both from an artist called Piper's Art her name is Philippa and she's from Bot Botgo, I think um, so uh, this is a pretty big bag you're seeing a minute like I usually only go to grocery store like one a week and if it's like all my groceries without any problems so um, obviously from day to day what I keep in my bed differs but um, this is just the day I went to the university to study and um, yeah I kept things inside uh, which I'm going to show you now so first of all as you can see um, you open this up like this I'm sorry the angle is like not the best but it's what we are working with right now I'm going to put this bag on the floor because otherwise it's way too heavy for me so first of all what we have is this like my notes that I write for my second board exam for my start exam in October um, and I just write down the subjects that we have for this semester and I write down like for example as you can see um, first of all, we have orthopedics and I write down the lectures we had and we uh, that I need to review and so like um, then I have a page where I write down the official study plan for the board exam that's a uh, hundred days study plan so those are like the main uh, organizational uh, pages and all the rest are like my real notes for this exam then I had my charges with me so I do usually uh, carry my iPad with me instead of my laptop because um, currently I'm not uh, writing a lot like uh, when I was writing my uh, doctorate thesis it's uh, much practical to carry my laptop with me however right now I mainly just read stuff on my iPad and do questions which is much more convenient on the laptop but I hate to carry a lot of 
stuff with me so I bet it is and uh, thankfully this charger can be used for my phone and for my iPad I am also filming on my iPad that's why I cannot show you my iPad today then we got this tote bag with me <laughs> just a Kaufland tote bag. Actually, fun fact is I live pretty far away from Kaufland and every time I got the chance to go there I'm so happy because usually I just go to Edeka and Kaufland has a much bigger selection on stuff but um, I go like once in a year or something because I'm just that lazy to travel very far away for grocery shopping but uh, I always keep, keep um, tote bag with me so that, you know, don't have to buy extra shopping bags to cause more damage to our environment. Then I got my wallet or my purse. So yeah, so this one I got this year because my old one that I used and that I loved got stolen when I was train or when I was waiting for the train like that was so stupid as a whole story and this compartment contains a lot of coins and then there is some cash in the uh, bigger compartment here that I'm not going to show you because it's just money it's boring well money is not boring but you know what I mean I also usually, not always, but a lot of the times, uh, take this journal with me. This is uh, like my all my planning is done on this in this book. So I really love this. So you can buy reviews, and as you can see, what I do is I really usually just do my own journals. And I didn't buy store-bought ones because although it takes some time to do it but when I do this um, thing I just listen to audiobooks or watch YouTube videos and it's pretty relaxing and this is like the spacing that I need I usually put uh, Monday to, to uh, Thursday on one side and then Friday to Sunday and as you can see, um, I usually mark out uh, like green is, for example, the lectures that or the seminars that I have to attend, and purple is uh, for like um, the lectures that I don't have to, but I have the option to visit. So I write down. Um, how many hours I study a day just to keep track and uh, before I tracked how much I really work I used to feel pretty good about what I studied but in reality I didn't spend much time study um, and sometimes I wasted too much time um, so it looks like I studied a lot but actually I was just procrastinating so then I started to you know track how much I really am studying since I think that three four years and it has been working great for me then I have this thing which <laughs> pink is so not my color but what it is is uh, something to hold your important documents for me for example the passport and uh, some um, other stuff like your uh, vaccine certificate and stuff so this is just my passport this is the, the new one that I got uh, so for China you have to renew your passport every 10 years and the new passport is actually so 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 beautiful um, I can show you because it's like every page it looks different on um, this page is oh yeah so every page they show a different province and uh, like the scenery from that province I think I can show you a couple of more maybe 
essentials in this one but uh, I sometimes also use this when I go jogging I also put my phone and some tissue paper inside and my key and it's just the perfect size you know so what I take with me tissue paper because <laughs> I have an um, allergy and you know sometimes you just need to keep it around and then this random sanitizer Is a relax.